this, believe it or not, is the elephant and castle. And let me tell you that if you find it quite unrecognizable, so do a lot of its oldest inhabitants nowadays. The London County Council has got one of its biggest redevelopment schemes underway here. The old public house that used to be on this corner, called the Elephant and Castle, has been pulled down, along with nearly everything else in the neighbourhood. And instead, up go the shiny steel and glass boxes to add to the chaos of London's modern skyline. Builders moved in on the site of what should be the heart of the new Elephant and Castle, a two million pound shopping centre which will have a rooftop restaurant, a doctor, a dentist, a couple of pubs, one of which presumably will be called the Elephant and Castle, a nursery for the kids, and an indoor heated concourse of a hundred shops so that you won't need to go shopping in the rain. It's a revolution in the shape of things around here. But will it be a revolution in the way of things? Fifty years, you said, yes, running a yes, poultry store. Yes. Do you think the elephant scheme is going to make any difference no to you? No difference at all. Why not? Why, why could it's value. Public, public opinion. London. Public opinion. This is the cheapest market. This is the cheapest market there is in London. Yes. The cheapest market there is in England, in a sense. And people are going to come for the price. Well, yes, the price. But supposing funny. they've got a nice, warm, heated place to go and sit in, have a cup of coffee, don't oh, you think that'll take them away? So, so, so they're going there at nine o'clock in the morning and going to stop there till nine o'clock at night. No. They go and do their shopping at home. Today, today, television knocks it out. Everybody wants to look at television Saturday afternoon. Mm. Is that correct? Yes. They want to get their shopping home and finish with. Mm. They're not going to say, <coughs> they, might, they might take an offence, all right, for the first couple of three months. It's like a baby with a new toy. Mm. The same thing. Yeah, I could have stole up there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you wouldn't like to have a shop there? No. Why not? Ten quid a week rent. We've had your rate. Fourteen, sorry, I beg your pardon. Fourteen. And how much do you pay here? Uh, uh, about thirteen and six, fourteen, Bob, for toll. Half a quid for stall. Half a quid story, about two quid a week, fifty, Bob, a week, up that top way. And that's the lot, is it? That's all. And this makes it possible for you to sell at lower prices, eh? Definitely. Of course it does. Of course it does. Uh, Thank you, know. you very much. Quite right. lived around here for some years. Do you think you'll go on shopping here after they start the Elephant and Castle project? Certainly, certainly. Why? Well, I foresee no project in the Elephant and Castle shopping scheme. <laughs> why, do, why don't you want to go? Uh, well, it's, well, it's obvious, isn't it? With the cost, with the cost of the building, then you won't get cut price stuff here, up there. You mean you get, you get lower prices? Of course you will. They yeah. can't afford to do it, can they? But they, if they offer you a nice heated interior in the winter and a nice... Offer you that indoors about five minutes to go to the elephant. <laughs> <laughs> While to go to shop in new stores in the elephant. Well, it doesn't appeal to me that way because I don't see how with the price of increased rent and uh, overhead expenses that they would be able to come anywhere near the prices of what we get in the market. Thank you very much. Have you lived here? 
Oh, approximately about 50 years. And your family before you? Yes, my father, my father's was over where the baker Lou is, and his father before him. My grandfather walked up from Nether Compton in Dorset near... Uh, in 1845. Well, if you've been here all that time, what are the big changes that you see now? Oh, a vast alteration. Now, it's become commercial the neighbourhood. It used to be tremendous population. On Saturday night, you could walk on the people's heads. And uh, today, there's nobody here. Where have they all gone? Well, they, the houses have been pulled down and they moved out, gone to the suburbs. Do you think this is new shopping centre is going to make any difference to your life? Well, I think it will be um, a lot cleaner to shop in. There's certainly there'll be more room to sort of move around. I think you'll lose the personal contact of the people behind the counter. But don't you think it will appeal to younger people like yourself here? Oh, yes, definitely. I think there'll be more room to... There you are. You can take a horse to water, but you can't make him drink. Now the LCC is taking the skyscrapers to the elephant. But will he learn to live with them? Maybe.